it is it is weird that it uses QR codes. That's like what what about people who uh Oh, come on, you should be able to scan this. Okay, so it's another code. So, right trigger, right... Left, right, left, 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 right. Cryptographer. Okay. It's another anti-cube. Like, yeah, I mean, that that's weird. It requires you to have a QR code reader. And not everyone does. <laughs> In fact, I don't think nearly anyone does. Because who the hell really uses QR codes? Like, I mean, I think the idea of them is neat and all, but you don't really, really use them, do you? Yeah, there's still a door up here. But to, to have that be a requirement for the game, like, that seems strange. And, you know, for me it's fine, but... For all those people who don't, or some people who might not even know about them. So this bit is cleared. There is still a door here, though. Ah, not a shortcut. I'm not sure what makes these shortcuts go. Like, what determines if they work or not. Like, I mean, I found some that just did not activate, so I'm not sure how that works. I would like to know. <laughs> Well, I think it's time for a big door. Big broken door. God damn it. That wasn't so bad. Is that on our full? It is. So, that is that room. Okay, so we're just missing a big room now. In this area. Whoa, what happened here? Yeah, something bad. Something bad, that's for sure. Right. So there still is a locked room somewhere. It's funny how long sometimes I have to look for a door. <laughs> You'd think it'd be really easy to find, but uh, not for me. Okay, so... That did not help. That was rotating the wrong way. Yeah, you can't do this by rotating. <laughs> so you just have to jump. Also works. I'm not sure what was happening there.
And this thing is just slowly rotating. Already in our bit. Ugh. That's what happens. Okay. Okay. Saw the anti cube there. It was hidden though. And it's a giant clock. Hey Gomez, do you know what time it is? It's cube o'clock. Oh dot. Humor really is not your thing. <laughs> yeah, it's time switch, yes. But I did see an anti cube in here somewhere. See, that's a regular cube, but I, s I did see an anti cube. Oh, don't tell me. I have to get. Whoops. Do not tell me that I have to get the anti cube and at a certain time or something. It was on one of these four little pillars, right? I feel there's something to do with time here. And with all the colors that it changes to. To be fair, how am I supposed to get down here? <laughs> yeah, it's just like, yeah, this is a secret. Can't fall on the uh, clock hand either. See, there it is. Fuck. Well. That is even more frustrating. Now that I know it's there. I just... I'd like to be able to get down from here. <laughs> I would really like that game. There's no good way to do that. Well, fuck it then. I don't see a good way to get down, so... There's not much I can do. So I guess a lot of those secrets are anti-cubes then. So if you solve whatever there is to solve there, you get an anti-cube. That seems... that seems fine. Um, apparently that had a branching door? Huh. Did it now. That was... That was the door all the way over there. See, now I have to wait, I have to get back up back there, and see where the anti-cube goes. Or at, at what time or something, or what specifically triggers it. Right, drop this. Yeah, I mean, the anti-cubes are going to take me way longer to get than the regular cubes, because for those you have to actually figure things out. Not sure what uh, triggers the uh, dimension stuff. Not sure about that. Yeah, it's cube clock. That's hilarious. Dot. 
Mm. So I guess we wait. Ever be the... What the fuck? See, so yeah, it's like... Huh? I didn't do anything... And... It sounds like it opened a door somewhere. Yeah, that's still the same. Or I guess it didn't. So how does this branch then? Now there still is a secret. Still, even with the anti-cube. There is still a secret that leads to another door. Something about the time then. Or maybe we have to wait for the time and a specific color. Could be something like that. Does this affect time? I can't tell. Now see, there's different time colors. Yeah, I'm, I'm confused by this clock. <laughs> this clock is baffling me. Whoops. That was not very smart of me. Right, so I guess I'll just go up and um, to the main warp gate again. Yeah, I'm really gonna have to spend some time thinking about a lot of these secrets and just messing around with them. Which is probably gonna take ages, so... Yay. <laughs> oh, it's probably just a certain logic or something. That for a lot of them, I guess. So... I'm not sure where, th where that is actually gonna take us. Not sure what that pattern is. All right, this. I think I want this. Fuck if I remember exactly where that uh, town was. See, this is not it. Are they all... They're, they're not... I mean, they're color-coded, but it doesn't say which color which is, right? Oh, no, it actually totally does. Okay, never mind. I'm just silly. Yeah, so we need the blue, I believe. But how do we get to... What we want is that... No, that doesn't seem right. It is from that area, though. No. Oh, come on. How difficult can it be? Notice the area just behind. Why is it making such a big deal about... That is the one. Jesus. Okay, so from there we take the blue. This blue? It's probably the light blue. 